Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today's video, I'm going to share with you guys one of my box boxes that I got from a program that I'm a part of. It's called Influencer. I'm going to go through everything, um, show you my box, and I'll even um, insert a clip of me doing all the steps and stuff. So just, just so you guys can get an idea of what the whole program involves. So this time, my box is a uniquely J box. And this is what it looks like. This is the packaging. This is actually a pretty big box. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys real time what um, you have to do in regards to when you get your box. So when you first get your box, um, I'm gonna go ahead and open it up. Um, every box usually comes with a little info card. Uh, it tells you pretty much the brand that uh, you were sent. And it has always the get started down here. Just log into your influencer, influencer uh, profile, checking your uniquely J box box and test out your products and posts on social using hashtag uniquely J box box. So I am going to go ahead and I use my phone and I do it through the app. I'm gonna go ahead and pull up. Ooh, wrong thing. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, pull up the app and check in my box. And basically, it's already on my profile. I'll scroll down to where the campaigns are. I do start campaign. And then I'll tap the thing that says I've received my box box. And usually um we can it'll automatically pull up a box where you can share that you got your stuff on social media so I'm gonna go ahead and do that type a little caption in here Facebook and my Twitter. I'm gonna do upload a video. Ooh, not to me. Let's flip that around and then go ahead and snap a photo. And then we snap a photo. Um, there's usually filters and stuff that you can do to edit the picture, but I'm gonna choose not to edit it and I'm just going to tap done and call it a day just for the sake of the video. And I'm gonna do share my post. confirming that it posted to any of my social media but most of the time the app keeps you logged into all of your social media so it's usually no problem you just uh, automatically upload to whatever you receive um and then you can
can scroll and see what everybody else got it looks like um some people got little snacks to eat and then some other people got some type of i don't know if it's a drink or what oh no it looks like cleaning supplies so uh, yeah um then basically it just shows what i received in here i got the uniquely j figment olive large crisp crisps the uniquely j almond mocha biscotti thins and the uniquely j slider freezer gallon bags uh cute up and then when you tap on the th the badge it gives you different things that you receive different points for uh get 40 points for showing off on instagram 20 to review the crisps, 20 to review the freezer bags, and 20 to review the biscotti things. And then a the bonus, uh, it looks like follow Jet on social media. So, yeah. And basically each badge has a set amount of points. This one has 100. Uh, usually, uh, once the weeks or so go on they usually add like a, a extra badge where you can do other activities and get points for those and then the more badges and stuff that you complete the more uh the more they send you notifications to actually uh i'm sorry people are just texting me But like I was saying, uh, the more points you get, the more likely you are to receive more surveys in the future to get other boxes of stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and read the card. It says, Meet Uniquely J, the brand new brand from Jet.com, www.jet.com slash Uniquely J. Um... And then on here always says you must disclose in your social posts that you receive these products complimentary for testing purposes. Um, then on the other side it says, Jet, no one wants to feel like they're making trade-offs. And when you shop Uniquely J, you never will. Because from quality to price to design and beyond, Uniquely J products bring together everything you care about. The freezer bags are BPA free, the biscotti thins are delicious, and the all-purpose cleaner doesn't just look great on your counter it's made from plant derived ingredients say goodbye to deciding you just found your new favorite thing and then it'll have, it has an asterisk at the end members will not receive all products so i guess on the other posts um that i saw that people posted those liquid things were uh, like i said uh household cleaning products so for the sake of the video i will also um, show you the items that came in the box these look like the slider freezer bags this is what the box looks like the box is really cute um, yeah box is really cute I'll go ahead and open it to show what the bags look like and I don't know about you but in my house we use plastic bags all the time it has frosty fresh down at the bottom and it's just your traditional looks like traditional zipper gallon bag and those are the freezer bags and then this is the box of the almond mocha biscotti thins for people that care it looks like it's 120 calories um so let's go ahead and open this up and try these out this is what they look like i mean i don't really care for i guess mocha or things that are mocha and i don't really like almonds either so we shall see first of all This packaging is ridiculously hard to get up. Okay, but anyway, 
I got it. So uh, I'm going to try a piece. Yeah, I don't like mocha, so I might probably not like these. Um, because it already smells like coffee to me, and I don't like coffee either. Um, um, actually, not bad, but still, not anything I would really buy. But I do know a lot of people. Are I would tell this about because there's a lot of people I know that like stuff like this. So, yeah. We're gonna put that back in the box. Mm. I should have brought some water. Okay, so this is the Fig and Olive Large Crisp. For people that care, these are 110 calories. So, 10 less than the other ones. Actually, the more this is not really that bad. It's not bad. Now, the, it don't really taste mocha y. That's the word, mocha y. I taste like more chocolate, but still. Okay, and this is what these look like fig and olive. I still, to this day, don't really know what a fig is. Can't say that I've actually seen a picture of a fig. I probably have. But it's one of those things, like, I wouldn't know if I saw it. Like a fig and Newton. Or those little, those little, um, snack things. Those are good. So, I mean, I like olives. I like some big Newton things. This is what the little cracker looks like. Right. Mm, this ain't really nothing special either. It says salty meat sweet, but yeah, it says salty. The little fig. I mean, that's the sweet part, but, I mean, ain't nothing to really write home about, but, I mean, I mean, they're decent. Like I said, I know people that like stuff like this, but I'm more likely to put them tasting and see if they like it, if they like it, honey, they can have it. But yeah, that's pretty much what I got in this box. Um, if you guys want to see more videos like this, just let me know in the comments below. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Because I've tried everything. And I'm definitely going to use these little freezer bags. Um, I could go ahead and do the reviews and stuff like it says to do on the app right now. But... Yeah, that's pretty much as far as the program. I'll leave my link below, so if you want to sign up, you can sign up. Um, but yeah, anyway, thanks for watching. See you later, guys. Bye.